It sounds like the plot of a classic fish out of water movie. When people hear of a Jamaican skier, they expect, you know, dreads hanging out the back of my helmet and a smoke stream following me down the mountain. The only smoke you might see from this serious competitor is coming off his skis. Born in New York and raised in California ski country to a Jamaican father and an American mother, the 23-year-old holds dual citizenship and could have raced for Team USA, but he decided to compete in the upcoming Olympics for the land of his father, who passed away when he was a teenager. I think it's more than just a country, it's your father, it's a passion, it's what my mom fell in love with. She graduated from Stanford and moved to Jamaica, fell in love with that people, and it really changed her life. And to see something, you know, have that strong, you know, of an influence on your parents, it it really rubs off on you. Errol will compete in a new Olympic event called Ski Cross. Instead of racing against the clock, four skiers fly down a narrow course with twists and turns at the same time, often bumping into each other all the way down. You know, it's one of the most extreme sports. You're going 80, 90 miles an hour with just spandex and a crash helmet on. You know, you don't have a car around you. You don't have everything else, and you're flying, you know, 100 feet through the air. Errol actually built this starting gate and put it right in his front yard so that he can practice at home 24-7. Errol lives with his mother, who says her late husband would have been extremely proud his son is competing for his homeland. And to be able to see Errol grab a hold of that and say, let's take this a step farther, let's put Jamaica on the map of skiing is... It's beautiful. Errol's finished as high as fifth in recent international competition. If he can manage to crack the top three in Vancouver, he'll become the first athlete from the Caribbean to medal in the Winter Olympics. I've already proved myself on the world stage, so it's not like we're just, you know, a shot, a shot in the dark. You know, we're here to put a little island on the map of international skiing. By taking this cool running story to the extreme. Haven Daily, the Associated Press, Tahoe City, California.